Hello, one and all. This is Luckless Love Locks. Welcome to No Clue Vember here on twitch.tv slash Luckless Love Locks. We're starting things off uh, with Conway disappearance at Dahlia View. Although they pronounce it Dahlia View in the game. So let me know how you pronounce it in the comment section and in chat. Um, I'm going to be playing investigation games, crime solving games on stream, maybe some on YouTube as well for the month of November. As always, let me know about the volume. Pumpkinhead, good to see you. Uh, right now, I know it's quiet, but the dialogue gets to be quite a bit louder as we get in. Let's begin. Conway, disappearance. A dolly of you. Oh. Again. Hey, Van Dumbo. English, yes. 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 The intro is pretty cool. The King's Speech. Christmas Eve, 1940, 1859. That's 6.59 p.m. Welcome, Miro. I'm a little sniffly today. Hmm. Trembling. I love mystery games. Dover Lane. Of course, you guys could help me. No, I think this this game will be better off without it. Uh, Cam. I don't know, I've been feeling the cam lately. Dodger, how's it going? You cure right at the start. Could that, could that have been a lady? Hey, Vinter! So good to see you. It's, I feel like it's been a while. Been a while. Hope you're doing well. No, I don't have a cold. I think I just have a little, uh, Izzy. Yes, I saw you join the Discord. Um, I think I, I, I just, I get a bit congested, uh, in the morning at 2.30. When I wake up, I seem to get congested. I did finish House of Ashes. Yes, did it in one shot. I like this cinematic intro. The other thing I like about this is it's very understated. Very real, realistic. But I like the style too. Graphics, kind of like a cell, kind of like cell shaded ish. Marie is the name of the child. Thank you, Blacko, for the 50 months. Happy Detective Month. What's it called, Blacko? Child was snapped. Hello, Richie. June 22nd, 1954. 14 years later. A dolly of you. Oh, as a new mom back in the day, that was For that was your worst part of my later years. I worked as a private investigator. I'd seen many a terrible case. Sadly, most of them unresolved. But in 1954. Something terrible and far closer to home happened. 
that I could not avoid. And it happened right here. In Dahlia View. See, Dahlia. Literally just waved at the PC screen when I whispered hello. It's one of those days. So it sounded like a window broke and then someone ran away or a bottle bottle broke. Pumpkin head, thank you so much for becoming a patron. It's six to ten. The police are here. What on earth is all the commotion? Yeah, it is kind of like telltale graph or uh telltale graph. I think I'm gonna turn the uh Dialogue volume back up, actually. It seemed loud before, but... This is us! Did I... Hold on, one more thing. Yeah, okay. It's okay, Black Everyone camp. else has been able to figure it out. I need to see what's going on outside. One day you'll put it together. Okay. I need my camera. Can we see anything else here? So, uh, chat, I'll be depending mainly on you guys to remember everything. So I don't have to. Now, I can get a closer look. I think he's a retired detective. We'll find out, I guess, eh? What on earth is all the commotion? So this is, I don't know if you guys have ever seen Rear Window. It's an old Hitchcock movie. This is, uh, has that kind of vibe. Ooh. Smashed pump. I, I must have slipped through it. Smashed during attack. That he won't be an alcoholic, only noir detectives. Hit the juice. <laughs> Miro's got this all figured out. Hey, Mock. I wonder if Catherine is with them. Oh, who's Catherine? Not important. Daughter, maybe? Theodore and Annabelle McKee, I believe. I really should get to know my neighbors better. Were they attacked? Tony Morgan's blood, blood force trauma. It's kind of funny, like there's no way they would write that <laughs> down on there, right? But they have to, right? Because it's like, that's the game. Might have to zoom in a little further. Well, that's Tony Morgan's blood. That sure oh, likes though. I hope he's all right. Please let him be all right. Huh. It's weird that the animations of the uh, people are like lower f FPS. Harold Levy owns most of the flats in Daily View. I wonder if he saw something. 
Well, I'm pretty sure it's not Alan Rickman. <laughs> Yikes. He, he passed away, didn't he? Rip. Or it did... He did, right? Levy, okay. No, oh, it's... It's... He was just the best, wasn't he? Figured that would be important, no? Oh. Shirley Downs. She runs the crow's nest. Her office overlooks the courtyard. Another clue. It says Charlotte May bound during abduction. Bound during abduction? Dear God. Charlotte May, Mr. Morgan's daughter, has been kidnapped. Old Mrs. Doer. She's usually peering through her window watching our neighbors. It's past her bedtime. Oh, Bowie, George Michael. Yeah, maybe. Or no, I think it was before then, fortunately. I know, really, it was too soon. Rickman was one of the greats. Oh, there's another clue here. Possible chloroform drugging? Chloroform? What on earth? Hey, noise crypt. Got your crazed uh, big conspiracy face at the ready. I need that. I need that help. I wonder if there's a point where... Found everything. Hours. Royal Britannia Hotel. Did I miss anything, guys? I don't see anything else. Leave observation. A kidnapping right on my doorstep. That hasn't been thinking about. Imagine if it was Catherine. Time to pay my neighbors a visit and see what they know. Catherine, I guess, is our, our daughter, maybe? Just got back from the eye doctor. Currently can't really see what's happening on screen. Oh, that's not going to help. Why isn't it raining? Good point. It's in Britain. Notepad. Oh, this is cool so far. Objective. Something has happened in Dahlia View. But what? I need my camera to see what's going on outside my window. Go to the window, find out what's happening. Talk to the Dahlia View residents in the courtyard and find out what they know about Charlotte May's abduction. Oh, neat. Movement style standard, camera centric. I think, so this is like, if it's standard, it's like tank control. So if I hit W, it's forward always. I think I'll stick with that. I haven't played a tank control game in a while. Sounds like fun. It's the way the old Resident Evil games used to play. Mm -hmm. 
And one of my favorites, Grim Fandango. Oh, did I miss a tire track, she wolf? I don't need to bust all that. Is there anything over here? Is there any reason to like... Go this way? Probably not. Eh? Maybe later on we have to? Yeah, we are. It really is like a room with a view, yeah. We are in a wheelchair. So in a room with a view, he, he's, he's uh, I think, a journalist or something, and he broke his leg. I really enjoyed a uh, room with a view. You guys should watch that if you haven't yet. Charlotte May could only be seven or eight years old. Why would someone want to take her? It doesn't make any sense. Cool. Hello, Mr. Conway. Good evening. Terrible what's happened, isn't it? So you know what happened. They're looking for a kidnapper. A search is about to start in the Pine Woods. My sister, Shirley. She owns the pub across the way. The searchers are all meeting there first. What do you know about the kidnapping, Mr. Conway? Not much. But that's why I'm talking to the pair of you. You should talk to the old busybody over in her big manor house. Mrs. Doer. She knows everything Wanna grab that? that goes on here. Blicko? I wouldn't be surprised if she saw the kidnapper. I wouldn't be surprised if she was the kidnapper. Can you ban that an one Naira person? Well, Thank you. Have you seen her? Always fawning over that little girl. All alone in that big house. Plenty of room to hide someone. I can see that you've put a lot of thought into this, Mrs. McKee. A little too much, love. Well, I'm not the only one who thinks it. Oh, blast. What time is it? Uh, it must be a little after midnight by now, surely. The search is starting without me. I have to get my coat. Uh, you'll forgive me, Mr. Conway? Uh, yes, good night. Good night, Mr. Conway. Uh, yeah. We'll talk is. again soon. She's very judgmental. Agreed. <laughs> okay. Not a ton to go with there. This guy's kind of leering at everything. Uh, good evening, Mr. Levy. Evening. How strange times we live in when a girl can be taken on your doorstep. You ain't wrong. It's a bloody mess. Did you see what happened at all? No. Uh, how well did you know Charlotte May? You lived next door. You yeah, the graphics are nice. Up. I like the style. I hope they're going to clean all this mess up tonight. I've got a business to run. I'm sure this must be a great inconvenience to you. Huh. That reminds me. Rent day tomorrow. Don't be late. I haven't forgotten. Good. Keep it that way, and we'll get along just fine. May I ask what you were doing tonight? No. Well, they're trying to establish him as the villain. Okay. So probably he's probably not the one that did it. Excuse me, Mr. Conway, may I have a moment? Okay. You see something? Mm -hmm. 
do you know what's happened? Never mind all that. Your daughter is a police officer, is she not? She is. Here, I found this. Uh, you can select it. Brooch. Ah, well, what's this then? A brooch. I found it on the floor here. It probably belonged to that poor girl. Thought I'd better pick it up before Shirley Downs gets her mitts on it. What do you mean by that? Never mind. Perhaps you can make sure it finds its way to your daughter. I will. And thank you for telling me. Just doing my duty. Can you tell me what you meant about Shirley? Good night, Mr. Conway. Did you see anything else? Hey, everyone's Just so helpful. Make sure to give your daughter that brooch. You think the old lady did it? Why? Du, 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 du. It's okay, Buttercup. I'm sure your comment was just an innocent one. Like I was just letting you know that he's bothered Miss by it. Downs, do you have a moment? I'm, I'm sorry. What, what did you say? I can come back if you need some time. No, it's fine. I'm, I'm just... I can't believe this is happening so close to home. Well, maybe I can. What do you mean by that? Not everyone in Daily of You is as they seem, Mr. Conway. Aha! Uh, Miss Downs, who are you referring to? That son of a bitch right there, with the smug look on his face. Uh, Mr. Levy? <laughs> Why not? I mean, what do you really know about him? Well, I pay him my rent once a fortnight, but no other than that. I didn't really speak to the man. Well, sadly I do. He's up to something. You must have noticed all the strange deliveries coming and going at night. You think he took Charlotte May? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. I'm sorry. Uh, Miss Downs, uh, what are you basing this on? Gossip simulator, yeah. <sighs> Experience, Mr. Conway. You'll excuse me, I, I need to have the police with their search. Well, she is implying that he could be part of some kind of organized crime. Oh, there's Mr. Morgan. Okay, let's see. Oh, I can look at these. Ah, nice. Nice, 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 nice. nice. Blood stain with a metal flex. Mr. Morgan must have taken quite a hit. Let's take a look at was there was another um, evidence thing over here, right? I have to get around to the side. Oh, maybe I can't look at this. It's kind of interesting. It's like... It's hard to maneuver, but it would be, you know? Something uh, we'd have to deal with. So we could just look at the one piece of evidence. Okay. For whatever reason. Hello, Mr. Morgan. My name is Robert Conway. I live in flat 23. Yes, uh, I've seen you around, Mr. Conway. Well, you see, I thought I'd better come over and check you're okay. Some of our neighbors seem to be content just to stare. I'm so sorry to hear about your daughter. Very kind of you. 
Why is he so quiet? I'm sorry, but I'm late joining the search. I've been talking to the police for over an hour. Of course, I understand. The police officer you spoke to was most likely my daughter. Is that so? Yes, she's a very determined young lady. If anyone is going to find your daughter, it's her. Well, I was once a private investigator myself. So it's just not balanced. <laughs> well, it's comforting to know I'm surrounded by such competent minds, Mr. Conway. I'd like to offer my services too, if you'd permit me. That's very kind, but I, I don't have money, I'm afraid. Oh, Mr. Morgan, no. I'm a father myself. I meant to say that I'm at your disposal. Very generous, but the police said that... All I'd be doing is observing and talking to people. And if I find anything, I'll be sure to share it with Catherine. Catherine? Uh, my daughter, the police officer. Right, of course. And that reminds me. I have this brooch. Does this mean anything to you? That's Charlotte Mays. You see how the simplest detail can be overlooked. Even by the police. Best to have as many eyes on the case, in my experience. Basically, my daughter is a shitty police officer. <laughs> May I have it back, please? Would you mind if I kept onto it for a day or so, in case it proves to have some use? Ye yes, of, of course. If you think it would help, I would very much like you to return it back. <laughs> as soon as I have something to report back to you, you have my word. So, where do you suppose you begin? Well, all right, Mira. Right here. In Dahlia View? Yes. It's my experience that it's usually someone who knows the victim. Do you mean to tell me that one of my neighbors has my girl? Uh, no, no. I I'm merely saying that it's a logical place to start. Now I see. That's why the police search my house. Because I'm a suspect, I suppose. That's the way it works, I'm sorry to say. So they're not even looking for the real kidnapper? I can assure you they will be. Tell me, Mr. Conway, and be honest. Are you going to look for my girl? I promise you, I'll stop at nothing until I find her. For now, I need you to think of anyone who could have taken Charlotte May. I don't know. Think of anyone or anything at all. Mr. Conway, who do you know who could do such a thing? I see your point. Well, for now, perhaps try to get some rest. Charlotte May needs you to be strong for her. You'll excuse me, Mr. Conway. I'm going to join the search and find my little girl. That's fair enough, Mr. So she got, he got hit on the head. And good luck. Good night, Mr. Conway. Yes, we're playing Gloomhaven tonight. Yeah, so what's going on here is like, sometimes the dialogue's really loud and sometimes it's quiet. I have an idea though. We can do this. And then I can control the volume manually. And I'll put the audio dialogue back at one. See, I could turn it up and down as we go. Um, been watching Deadly Premonition playthroughs. So this audio balancing is like heaven. We're getting back to. We're gonna be restarting Deadly Premonition two on Saturday. So more audio balance fun. Okay, new objective it says I should return home to piece together the information I've collected. All right. Kind of it kind of hints at hints uh, to you based on the camera positioning where you're supposed to go next. Dad? Catherine. I thought I might bump into you tonight. Well, I shouldn't be here. What with you living so close? Conflict of interest and all. Are you finished here? Almost, yes. Are you okay? Yes, I I'm fine. It's poor Charlotte May I'm worried about. Anyway, look at you. I rarely get to see you in your uniform. You look good. 
Thank you. I wish it was a little more comfortable. Catherine's voice is so much Catherine, quieter. Can I ask, what have you found? I'm not allowed to tell you. You know that. Besides, I don't have all the details myself, and my sergeant isn't exactly forthcoming with new recruits. Hang in there. You're an asset. They'll come to see how intelligent you are. Thank you. All I can say is that it looks as though Tony Morgan's daughter has been kidnapped. Awful news. May I ask why they're searching the Pinewoods? Do they know where the kidnapper went? Nah, they just screwed up in the sound balancing. It's a dead end. We're clueless, but we can't be seen to be doing nothing. And the locals suggested the woods, so... I mean, yeah, there are people that speak quietly, for sure. I just wonder if I oh, should not have to my neighbors yeah. again. Hang on, again? Y yes, Catherine, I've been thinking, and... Dad. What? I know this is happening on your doorstep, but please, don't get any ideas. I'm a naturally curious person, you know that. You don't do this anymore. Leave it to us, please. Well, do the police have any ideas? Dad, I mean it. Don't get involved. Well, I'd like to help you. I want to do this on my own. I didn't realize what this means to you. I meant to say... I want to do it the right way. By the book. Please promise me. Give her the thing! Okay. I... I promise. I think I'm gonna end up I not liking Conway. Up to you. <laughs> Thank you. Anyway, I'd better be off. I have to make a statement before the morning press. My sergeant is finally trusting me with something. Well, you'd better hurry. I'll look out for your article in the morning paper. Right. I'm off. Please go back inside. You'll catch a chill. Night, my love. Night, Dad. The last thing I want is to upset Catherine. I can tell how serious she is about her case. I've never seen her so driven. I suppose I'll still develop the photos I've taken of the crime scene. I might have captured something that the police did not. I won't be stepping on Catherine's toes if I stay in my flat, out of the way. I don't know why he didn't give her the approach. Okay, 7.34, the next morning, Conway's flat. Yeah, we are like voyeurs. We're just looking in on these people's lives. Sometimes controlling them. Puppeteers. The police have marked out several pieces of evidence that are likely related to the attack. However, Mrs. Doer handed me a brooch that was found at the scene. Mr. Morgan later confirmed it belonged to Charlotte May. Could the brooch be a missing piece of the puzzle? Answer question to solve evidence board. Take the pin from the question to the relevant piece of evidence. I wonder if finding where the brooch was dropped could help build a better picture of the attacker's movements. Oh, okay. A photo I took of the courtyard this evening. Oh, interesting. This is where it was dropped, right? I wonder if finding where the brooch was dropped could help build a better picture of the attacker's movements. Oh, like that. So, if Mrs. Dill was right about where she found the brooch, it means... The kidnapper must have come past her manor house at some point okay. during the abduction. Oh, I forgot to give Catherine the brooch. Oh, there you go. It just hasn't been a good time. There you go. He it said he forgot. Like I have mail. They play Ella Noir. Yeah, yeah, I did way back in the day. It's okay. I like it more than a lot of other people. In the game's got some issues. <laughs> I think they could have just. 
They kind of ditched the open world part. I should check what that mail was through my door. Focused on the other parts that are good. Yeah, I enjoyed it. I would play it again in VR if uh, I ever get the opportunity. Now what's this? Uh, it's just, there's nothing. Wait. How do I... Can I not open it? Huh? Well, I was up pretty late, guys, playing uh, Darkest Dungeon 2. <laughs> I'm sorry. I did not plan on streaming that long. I started at like 8 and I just kept going. <laughs> um, okay. I'm confused. Oh, I hit it doesn't teach you, but you hit W A S D to okay. It should it should probably uh say that. It says, I apologize for my shortness last night, Mr. Conway. I realize that you are trying to help me. I've already told the police, but the only people who I think could have taken my Charlotte May are our neighbors. The McKees, Harold Levy, Shirley Downs, and old Mrs. Dewar all have access to the courtyard. You said yourself, I think you might be onto something. You said yourself, and I think you might be onto something. More eyes on the case can only be a good thing. Thank you again for the offering to help. T. Morgan. Mr. Morgan's note implicates most of his neighbors. Yeah, Jimmy Stewart. I had suspected as much, but now I have something solid to work with. Catherine has asked me. Oh, there's the brooch. Involved, but I've already promised Mr. Morgan I'll find Charlotte May. I should have told Catherine there and then. I'm already involved. I can feel it again, that drive, that first pull at the yarn. It's all on this evidence board. Uh, I don't... Suspects, victims, I'll play whatever's in the remaster items, for items. Alan Wake. I have everything. All that remains is to watch over my neighbors until one of them makes a mistake. And I can still give Catherine her space. If the whole town is searching the Pinewoods, someone needs to keep an eye over Daily View. All right. 